Hello everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel and for today we're gonna be hanging these bird reflector that we have bought online. So we have 12 pieces of this. It comes with this string or like a rubberized rope at the end and I find it too short so I'm gonna be attaching another string just to make it a bit longer and so I have actually created a separate vlog about the unboxing and the price for this you can just check our unboxing channel but anyway we are now here at our rooftop and we are ready to hang these bird repellent rods and just for a quick update our succulents are all okay and even the roofing of our greenhouse is also fine so it's still windy as of today but still the rain has stopped and I think it's the best time for us to start hanging these bird repellent rods We are finally done hanging everything and I'm not so sure if the rods that I have hang is enough or I should add more so definitely I will be giving you another update probably after a month if it's enough or it would really keep the birds away from coming in our greenhouse. I actually place all of the 12 bird repellent rods at the back area because that's the area where the birds usually come from. And so these are some quick update of our cyclones. They all survived the typhoon and probably if the birds won't come in, I will start propagating and collecting succulents. The rods that we are using is about 12 inches long by the way and they are very lightweight and I really hope that it would really scare the birds. Probably this would help confuse the birds and eventually avoiding our greenhouse and by the way this is the area where you usually see in my vlog but i think one of these days i will start renovating the other parts of our rooftop so as you can see the roofing of this diy greenhouse that i have made here is gone but it's intentional i literally remove it before the typhoon comes as a way of preparing but this area is where i usually take my time-lapse video of the other side of the mountain and I'm thinking of setting up a mini garden here. It's like an area where I can actually sit, read a book, drink coffee and I think I have to remove this temporary like railing that I have added here. So that's just our quick update. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. You may also visit our Facebook page, A Desert Succulent PH.